I think umpiring is a great career for a, a per, any person, young person especially. I think it develops leadership skills, communication, how to manage people, making decisions. Uh, those sort of things I think are good character builders for young people and it can be a very rewarding career. I'm John Taylor, umpire's coach. Hi, Sebastian. Hello, Sebastian. Nice to meet you. I'm John. Tracy. Hello, Tracy. And you're looking to do field umpiring or boundary umpiring? Field. Field, excellent. Three years ago we introduced a national umpire mentor program. Now, Scott's going to be your actual mentor um, throughout the season. So um, Scott will be looking after you basically week to week while you're up and running. One of our biggest issues in umpiring was the young person coming to umpiring for the first time had no support. So the mentor program is there to have a senior person umpiring on the ground with them, showing them the way how to umpire, give them some confidence, give them some support. Danny, this is James. How are you going? Danny's going to be your mentor for the season, so he'll be seeing you quite often for the first few weeks while you're getting yourself organised. Hello, Sebastian, on behalf of AFL and the Waverley Junior Football Association, present you with your kit. This is James. James is doing his first season. Welcome. In the green shirt program, so I'll be out there today with him, Terrific. running around. So. We'll give you a lot of support. Well done. Well, well done. Well done, James. Yeah, James, we're just going to take all the boots and make sure they're all on the stuff. So, blues. Just a little tap on the boots. Just take all the boys to the bottom. I'll work my way through that way. Righto, Ruckman. Eyes on the footy. All right, Ruckman. Eyes up. Everybody out of the square, guys. Mark's here, guys. One on the mark, one on the mark, just the one. Good. And he's back! Good. Your ball number 12 is going. We train the mentors, so we put the mentors through a training program and encourage them to communicate with the young umpire. And that's a part of the program, is to provide that support and really just give them a push along, the confidence to go the next step when they umpire by themselves. Good mate, good. Back there, guys. Come back. back there. Play on now. Play on Mark here. Play on. Come with me. This side, this side, stay on the fat side. Alright, keep running. Almost common side here. We've just got a lot of talk needed. Yep. Talk to him, tell him they're not there. Play on, guys, play on. Hi, right, over the shoulder. Good. Good. Get in there. Just to have someone there to help you feel better and help you through it all and tell you you're doing a good job at times and confidence really. Right there, 18. Now back X, mate. Good. Great half, mate. Yep. First one done. Round one, so that's a big one out of the way. Yeah, you did well. Three into the deep end there, and you managed yourself quite well. Good free kicks paid. Yep. Those in the backs were spot on. You know, just got to use your voice a lot more. Yeah. I've got to hear from wherever I am, OK? A couple of things I've got to work on is just the voice being a lot louder. Boundary throwing, so we've just got to work on a little bit as well. Got the right idea. Just got to sprint a little harder just to a side on for the contest. Yep. Other than that, you're doing real well, mate. Yes. Three cheers for the umpire, Biff. The pace of the game, how the game's played, like it's completely different to training. Like, you know, yeah. do you no, your thoughts you on that? Keep switching between slow and fast, and when they kick the ball out fast, you got to go with them. Uh, Glen Iris Blue at 3422 versus East Malvern Blue at 128. What's the main thing that you probably picked up uh, today? Voice, to keep Boy. talking to players and yeah. keep telling them where the mark is and everything like that. Yeah. yeah, yeah, very good, very good. I noticed that too, that your voice from the start towards the end got better. Yeah. And the way that you were telling the players and encouraging them. Yeah. I've come from Kuwait, I've been studying over there, and I've come here to study uh, in, in a university in Deakin. I just knew it was a famous game here played in Australia, and um, I wanted to take part in it. And I was told about this new green shirt program. I got the green shirt, and I got a mentor who helped me through and taught me everything. Boys, nice in the ball! Clear on! Most of all, it gave me the confidence to go out there and uh, do the job, and it was very helpful. It taught me all the rules, taught me everything step by step, 
and it was easy on from there, you know. Great free kicks again, Stuart. Thank you. Couldn't have played any more, and very clear. It was really good. Thank good you. indication, so all the yep. crowd knew exactly what was going on. That's half the battle, of course. Uh, this is my fourth year now. Yeah, I started off when I was in year seven um, as a boundary umpire and then uh, into my next year when I was in year eight I uh, moved over to field umpiring and uh, stayed there ever since but I keep boundary umpiring for school though. So I'd like to make it to the AFL uh, eventually in my career, hopefully umpire a grand final or two. It's one of my long-term goals. The next progression is to field umpiring, so it'd be a nice sort of step going in there once I sort of get a handle of the rules and stuff like that. I think uh, field is sort of where it, it'd be great to go with. Helping out kids would sort of be a good goal, so that's the next step, I suppose. Today's awards day is an annual event. Uh, it's about recognising the contribution that all of the green shirt umpires, their first year umpires, and their respective mentors have made to uh, community football. Sebastian went really well. Um, like all first year umpires when they first come down, they uh, are a bit tentative, but Sebastian really improved during the year, gave me a few little tricks, a few little tips to do, and I think you'll find Sebastian next year, he'll, uh, he'll go up the grades, definitely. Uh, found my first year really good. I learnt a lot of things, uh, had a lot of help along the way and it was a lot of fun. Can't wait for next year. Uh, Scott, who's been one of the mentors and come around to the games and helped out at training and given all the guys a lot of advice. Play on. Love to be back next year and have another crack at it. In the future it'd be great to umpire here at uh, the Melbourne Cricket Ground and fantastic in front of a large crowd. Well done. Good work. Good work. Well done, mate. Thanks very much. Good on you.